So I made it back home after a dangerous day out in the streets of Columbia. So today, I'm going to Central right now in order to film a little intro for Francisco's episode. He's a 7'3 Venezuelan, um, played professional basketball. He just has an amazing story. Man, I've had two relaxing days. Friday, yesterday was really relaxing. Today will be another relaxing day, but each day I, I seem to always get some things, some things done. Um, this is a big week for me uh, because I need to find leads and do demonstrations for potential customers um, these are the early days these are the early days I'm the first salesperson and, um, and I really believe I can get it up to 10,000 a month uh, I think the hard part right now is that from Columbia I can't cold call or I just can't pull up to games and talk to parents and things like that so that's the one of the things that I'm thinking about um, as far as having access. So I believe once I talk to parents and once I talk to coaches and things like that, they will understand the product and want to get on board. Uh, I just have to be able to talk to them. That's the hard part about it is to find these uh, customers, potential customers, in order to uh, to sell them on the product, do demonstrations. The product is completely ready, man. Uh, on the U on the U screen side, we had uh, um, <clears throat> our first customer for Noah, and that's what I think is going to be, man. The more vaults that we uh, that we that we do and we get people to to get their own dreamers well the more people are going to support these young people and we also sent Noah's first payment off to uh to him for uh for his his revenue so Noah's Noah's earned money he just earned another fifty dollars Yes, uh, yesterday, once the trial period is over, then we can send uh, the customer their dream, their Noah Harrison dream box, and that's what it's supposed to look like. It's that's exactly what it's supposed to look like, where you have the um, supporters supporting Noah, supporting the athletes, and they sign up through the video platform. And they have access to the athletes dreamers vault and they receive the dream box along with that subscription the subscription is a year subscription but they can also cancel at any time but uh, the athlete earns money every single time someone subscribes to their uh, dreamers vault subscription so yeah man it's exciting times This is gonna grow. This is gonna grow. Have to definitely watch um, watch everything right now and um, get customers. Get customers.
customers. So, third week getting into a nice routine. The gym, the workouts won't be as uh, as um, tiring, I would say, because getting used to it. And getting stronger and, and body is getting, is adapting to it. So I won't be as tired after the workouts. Get into the office by 12. Had to figure out the TikToks. Man, we have to figure out the TikToks. What day are we gonna film TikToks? I need to film at least, it needs to be a day where I film like five TikToks for the week. I don't know how I'm gonna edit those, but that's another thing that's on the list. Man, it's just so much to do, always. So much to do, man, so much to do. So much of the appeal of Cartagena comes from this right here. The waterfront and the weather. It's like on any day you can go to the beach and enjoy this beautiful seafront I mean look it's just gorgeous any day of the week because of the weather because of the access to this right here you can enjoy this to me <clears throat> this is that's the the largest attraction for me just to be able to come and enjoy this beauty anytime you want for me, it's a, the biggest attraction. And it's always great if you get out a, in the morning time when it's not many people. That's around and walk. what I love personally about being here one day I hope to own a boat or something like that I'm pointing at it that would be a dream of mine Just to own a boat like that. I spent a lot of time sailing, living on my boat, still doing all dreams. I always talk about <clears throat> selling, getting all dreams to a point where A bigger company wants to acquire it. Um, but I have to also ask myself, like, if All Dreams is making, if I'm making a million dollars a year from All Dreams and is running like a system, like, why would I sell it? You know, why would I sell it? Making good money. Um, doing what I love to do. 
because after project 45 it's going to be something else right <laughs> it's going to be another dreamer's vault of mine that i want to do and that's the it's the beauty of all of this but anyways yeah that's that boat right there i want that but i've never walked this far on this little trail right here so This is beautiful though. Ah. That's the boat right there. Right there. I see that in my future. See, a lot of times, <clears throat> a lot of times I just like to explore the city and just walk. Uh, I spend a lot of time walking, thinking, just by myself, you know. Places that, you know, trying to, you know, walk, walking places that uh, I've seen while driving past but really want to just <clears throat> enjoy and I use in golf a lot but you know just engulf myself into the city and treat treat us like a local just as I was just as I would treat it as if I was in if I was home you know and That's what I, you know, that's what I, that's one of the things that I enjoy. Is just, uh, really being present in the city, you know? I'm on my way to, to Mank, to Manga. <clears throat> so the clock tower right here, if you see, this is the sign for the clock tower you continue to walk it'll be that way we're going towards manga all of these beautiful boats right here that's boca grande over there castillo grande is over this way <clears throat> um But anyway, yeah, it's just so much that uh, this place has to offer. It's peaceful. It's very peaceful. When you do things like this and you just walk, just see the city, man. Look at it. Look at the city. Look at this. This is gorgeous, man. Look at this. You got Manga. <clears throat> this is Manga over here. I love this area. One day it would be cool to jump off this thing, right? <laughs> it's my first time walking over that bridge as many times I pass over this bridge because um, coming back from Boca Grande coming back from the clock tower going back to my barrio I have to cross over that bridge it's my first time ever walking that bridge so this is the basketball court here in Manga. This would be a good court to come work out at, at some point.
This is manga. I like the manga area. It's real tranquilo. I really like manga. <laughs> I want to get a, a high rise maybe in Castillo Grande soon. Um, soon could be a, a year, depending on how things play out. Um, but I also like, like manga as well. How could you not progress and how could you not? become something when you're able to just have peace and keep your mind on the goal and the things that you want to do and the things that you want to put into the world it's very very hard to to not do that while you're here and i think that's why i love it so much is because i'm able to just I'm able to just have peace and keep my mind clear to the things that I'm trying to accomplish and where I actually want to go. Uh, the sun every single day just helps your it just helps your your mood. Um, helps the way you feel. When you wake up, and you know, sun coming out at 6 a.m. and it's warm, you just, I just wake up ready to go, you know, ready to accomplish and take on the world. And not to mention, it just doesn't cost that much, <laughs> you know, so the trade off is just like, trade-off is when you weigh it on a scale the trade-off is massive in comparison to the things that I miss in the United States as a whole uh, And we make money through e-commerce, you know? And that's the key. If you can build something, you can make money through e-commerce, which is, this is the way of the world. It's 2024, it's the way of the world. Ah. The way of the world is not looking for some type of job that uh, that doesn't have longevity the way of the world is digital and if you're not looking to be get into the digital world or make money digitally man you lost and following after uh, people and the things that and how they make money. See, I would never, no matter how big how big all dreams ever get. One thing I'm never gonna do is I'm never gonna go on a podcast and say I did this and let me show you how to do it because I think each person's journey is isolated. And if you're doing things just for money, you're always going to come up short in the long run if your objective is to put something great in the world build something and you're thinking long terms you'll most likely
fail, but then you will create something that will win. All right, so right now I'm in an in drive, headed to Caribe Plaza. Again, I just wanted to take you guys on a stroll with me. It's a Sunday. Um, I just to grab some couple gym workout shirts at Kareem Plaza and then head back to the house and get ready to watch the bells later. Do some editing. Maybe upload this raw and uh, as like a Sunday daily vlog type of thing. And then um, Miguel was supposed to come at 3 o'clock, hang out with him, maybe go get some lunch. And then after that, go watch the bells. So, yeah, so they just kind of rolling with me on my day today. All right, so get this right here. It's like a little tank top, you know, get that. Get the get a white tank top as well. I like the long sleeve, so I'm gonna get a black long sleeve and a black short sleeve. So these are the things that I'm getting today as far as active wear and the exit. So these things are probably like ten, twelve dollars a piece. So, so I'm gonna get these. and headed back to the house right now. I was in the dangerous streets of Cartagena, Colombia. And I made it back safely by the grace of God. Now, let's enjoy lunch. Cut this video. My daily vlog. Sunday. <laughs> Please like, subscribe, and comment, and continue to follow this journey.